Hi, this is Corey from Woods, and today I'd like to talk to you about seed box disconnects on the Woods line of cedars. We've removed the safety shielding from this chain drive so that you can see what I'm talking about more easily. Depending on your application, you may want to use your cedar just for a tillage tool. And if you're going to do that, it makes sense to, to not run the chain drive to eliminate the possibility of additional wear for no good reason. If you wanted to do that, open your lower shield and remove the main drive pin out of the sprocket. Put it in the storage location on the end of the shaft so that it doesn't get lost. This will disconnect the entire ground drive from the drive roller. Now you may have applications where you're going to try to calibrate multiple seeds for different seed rates out of the individual boxes. In that case, you can disconnect the individual seed boxes by themselves as well. On the optional legume box here, on the drive shaft back here, there is a quick disconnect pin that you can remove to separate the seed box drive from the chain drive. On the cool season seed box, you'll have to pull the pin for two different shafts. One is the agitator shaft, and the other is the seed meter drive shaft. Again, in both cases, the pin has a storage location in the shaft. I hope this helps you with your seeder and all your seeding applications. You can find more about our products at woodsequipment.com or you can reach us at 1-800-31-WOODS.